Why is it that anything beer a uh, also been panning in Quada uh, have issue with Avrama? They always want to, they always want to turn the Muslim society you know, against Avram Ben Moshe. That's what I don't understand. Yes, Remo, yes, Remo. If you have issue with Avram Ben Moshe, you should concentrate on Avram Ben Moshe. Greetings, people. Special thanks to all my viewers and subscribers. I'd like to welcome you to the Righteous Messenger YouTube channel. It's your host, Righteous Messenger in the flesh. Yes. And people, if you saw the video from the beginning, a Muslim brother was asking the question, why is it that Christians in Ghana, or why is it that also Bempa and his boys, bunch of Christians, always inciting Muslims or Islam against Abraham Ben Moshe and the and the common sense family. People are asked this question as well. You see, if you are defending your faith or your religion, basically also Bempa and his boys are defending Christianity or their business. I would say that. And because they can't fight by themselves, because their God has got no powers to fight or defend himself or help them to defend him, now they are playing games by trying to incite Islam, you see, against Abraham Ben Moshe. And if you don't know, basically Abraham Ben Moshe is a free thinker who thinks religion is man-made. Religious books, he thinks, was written or were written by man to control the masses. And because of that, a lot of people are coming to the realization that, look, we can live without religion. You understand? We can achieve without religion. We don't need to go to church. We don't have to go to church to give offerings and tithes. And because of that, the churches or the pastors, they are, they are upset, they are angry, they are annoyed. So they are fighting against Abraham Ben Moshe and the common sense family. You see, please, let's go and watch some videos where Ousu Benpa, he claims, Ousu Benpa claims he is the nation's prophet in Ghana, you know, because he is affiliated to the ruling government or the party. And he claims he can raise people from the dead. He claims he sees prophecies or visions and he, 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 he they are from God sent to him. He even prophesied that Hillary Clinton would have won the, 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 the American presidency. People, like I was saying, he prophesied this Ousu Bempa, the nation prophet in Ghana. He prophesied that Hillary, Hillary, Hillary Clinton will win the election in America, the one where Donald Trump won. But Hillary, Hillary Clinton didn't win. And in Deuteronomy 18 verse 20, I stand to be corrected. And I paraphrase. He's saying that a prophet who prophesies and it doesn't come true, it means that prophet is lying and they might be put to death. So if they believe the Bible, I don't know why Osu Bempa is still walking the streets. Anyway, people, let's go and watch some videos of Osu Bempa and his boys inciting Islam or Muslims against Abraham Ben Moshe and the common sense movement. And when we come back, we will um free our minds yes nobody can sit down watch somebody like this insult and an imam like this thing sit down okay no true muslim 
will ever go and watch Afra in show pastors like this. No true Muslim. The religion. He is scared. Yeah, the religion too. He is scared of the Islamic people's show. We will say Christos will be cheap. Last week, I started recording. You know, your friend twice didn't know so the Bible blasting came for him. Don't you mean that? Don't Don't you Don't you mean that? I can't be truthful and sincere. Obey there. May the audio see me best and do. I can do the year. I'm sorry for them because the same thing by Muslims now. But who's a Muslim? No, it's a liar. Who's going to catch an imam saying he's going to send me a table? Who's going to send me a table? I'm a Muslim. 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 Now, the Quaker Shah Abraham said, Only the pastor at them. No, and only true Muslim. You don't go to your grand name, can I? Many because I was sorted them because it. Messi, let her remember the moon, yeah, me, yeah, for my spider, yeah, spider. Hey, Nami, besides, we follow Facebook and Grana. Nami, besides, a income of one man of a video at them. Oh, <laughs> 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 You lie bad. You can't. Who crown trust of the foul? But he did. Christians, watch him. Can you say that you will not see Muhammad? So people, the couple of videos I played, more than a couple actually, Ousu Bempa and his boys are saying that why should Muslims sit down? Or would Muslims sit down when Avram when Moshe is talking against Islam you see but to me this is wrong if you are fighting why are you trying to involve Islam or Muslims in your fight you see you guys claim your God is supernatural he's got powers he's got he's got also of um supernatural powers basically he's got the, the strength to create the whole world or the powers to create the whole world and he can't defend himself also bempa you know you and your boys you should ask god to strike avram ben moshe down to prove how powerful he is to prove that he's real you know but you can't do that because you know your God is not real. Church is a business. You know that. And you are using that to do people through collections and tithes. And Avram Ben Moshe is saying that, look, this is wrong. It's extortion. You know, but you guys, because of small that you chop, you don't want to lose small that you chop. So you are fighting against abraham ben moshe tarnishing him black or painting him black you know inciting islam or muslims against him and even this is not working because our muslim brother came and he spoke for abraham ben moshe he said that look abraham ben moshe speaks against islam as well but that will never change my faith but what he's saying is sensible so i'm going to listen to what he's saying and people, please, let's go and listen to what a Muslim brother is saying. Yeah. alaikum. This is Samuel the conference. Right? Yeah. Now, I need a Muslim in Kaya. 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 
Mendi manu tum kaka. Me Muslim. I will be more Kramusumu and up till now, so me Muslim. And nothing can change my mind. Never. I'm still a proud Muslim. But what I observe, and the reason why I'm a person with the man who told me, say, why is it that anything be a also been panning in Quada and have issue with Avrama? They always want to, they always want to turn the Muslim society against Avram bin Moshe. That's what I don't understand. Yes, Remo, yes, Remo. If you have issue with Avram bin Moshe, you should concentrate on Avram bin Moshe. Hey, amen. Mama, I say, I say, my person, my child, say, Avram bin Moshe, on to me, and come us, and come on for us. So, like, I don't know. I say, my person, my instigate, my person, my tiny Muslim society against Avram bin Moshe. But let me tell you one thing about Avram bin Moshe. It's high time Ghana, like, we have to celebrate someone like Avram Ben Moshe. I'm a Muslim, but someone like Avram Ben Moshe needs to be celebrated. I'm telling you. And I may not, may not as a Muslim, no. Sometimes, when I say the Ghana, I say, I don't know. I don't remember the last time I even picked up my Quran and, like, read recite through like go through it though if i'm praying i'll i'll i'll, I'll say the you know surat in the quran and pray but i don't remember the last time i sit, sat down and opened the quran by someone like avram ben Mushi, when he is attacking islam and attacking christianity you know it makes you as a follower to go back into your book and and read like critical reading to know whether what he is saying is true or not. Yeah, mechanism in Kremlin for yeah, like yeah, 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 they are going to home, they are going to home. Yeah, they are going to home. I'm not saying say more Christians, more yeah, they are more from a dream to home. May may come, may may be what the man can say. You shouldn't be like say. In Kamufu and Kamon Penny, Kamon Penny, so you want to turn in Kamufu again, eh, uh, Afran Bemushi. No, Afran Bemushi or a national hero. I'm telling you, or your national hero, Papa, because Afran Bemushi, he's not, he's not doing this fight for himself alone. He's doing it for even you, someone like you, a uh, spider, and the, I don't know, the Ousu Bempa boys. He's doing this fight for you. He's doing this fight for you. The cause of uh, Avram, his cause of fight. Before you start criticizing him, you shouldn't follow what the big dinos see. Ano, na yeyi sacrifice. Wow, men can say we shouldn't follow what just the nigger one that we will get now and sacrifice the huge one. That we will, we will bequeath to our children, children, children. They will be doing uh, the max will cry a thousand, thousand cities, five hundred cities, hundred cities. No, now you will go in and sacrifice a lifetime benefit for your own kids and kids and kids and kids. We should be very careful in what we are doing. And uh, yeah, Zungu, no, we are not like that. Yeah. Because you are telling telling us say Avram and say when the old cano and can come on for and come that be yeah in this hour yeah in this hour before you say something we analyze we analyze purely and see most of the more and more say a Muslim maybe in a new tunda you've always wanted to turn and come for society into Avram and that will never be possible into you know the moon tomorrow be moving free so that's not how we are me me a criminal pan but Avram be is the first time that I I heard Avram be I know this guy is making sense I know this guy is making sense 
all that he is saying for you pastor to, to stop extorting money from your con congregants that's all what he's saying and this coronavirus the two weeks confinement has confirmed your extortion of money from your congregants so we should be very careful in someone like Avram, i said it once again that he deserved to be celebrated not only in his only in his mechanism in his common sense fraternity no, but in islamic society and a christian society what did the make can i say but just give years to avram give years to avram ben moshi and listen to what he's saying i'm not part of common sense even though i use my common sense that's why i'm making this speech but i'm not part of that common sense thing no but i watch every single video of avram i watch every video that uh also Bempire and his boys will do to counter Avram. Social media no so you use papa. You use papa. Internet will be yeah DNA very sensible. You take it. If he does something that is contrary to 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 your common sense, you should reject it privately. You should reject it privately. And a better than Avram and Kasa you are you, you are extorting money from him from your congregants and your followers look with this two weeks uh is saying two weeks lockdown still the pastors has come on lines will be a short code about mobile money for what for what be honest for what does muslim society does that oh yes sir no, that doesn't happen, and that's what Avram Ben Moshe. That's and on mama nenyamu too much, you know. And on mama Avram Ben Moshe, it me nenyamu be brave now or kasa any time, no. There's too much extortion, too much extortion, money extortion in the Christian dom. No? I'm not saying you should stop, and I'm not saying you should continue, but just analyze, sit down, think sit down and think whether what Avram Ben Moshe is saying is true or not and young Kalim Krani said two weeks confinement you cried there Anka at least as a online church service no we yeah, are fine okay I see but online service is a very mobile money and film and no no yes I know quite as it but so I had a way now person would tell me yeah Muslim society on Avram media. Masa mo forget to cry in Yiduma. In Yiduma. Mo se mibra Zaki. Ena eh, push up king. Halifa. O mo be kasa yon. Mo se mo ba kasa biyo. Because the when moment you cry there. Anka. At least. Na ze online church service no. Mo ya fine. Ok yati. But. Online service is a mobile money and film. And no, 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 yes, I know, quite as it. But, so I do win a person with Tenny, yeah, Muslim society on Avram media. Master, more forget to cry, I eat my, I eat my. More send me, bra, Zaki, and a push up king, Halifa, or Mobe Kasai, or more so my Kasabi. Because they went back and sat down. And rethink again and saw that Avram Ben Moshe is a national hero. He is someone who is talking from sense. Men say you are not talking from sense. Men say you are not taking from uh uh been planning and comfort, you are not talking from sense. But go back and analyze whatever Avram Ben Moshe is saying. It's not Avram Ben Moshe is not attacking Uzu Ben Pilon. I knew say in Islamic society you know, Anka, we are doing something similar to what the Christian you know, society you know, are doing, collection, pain of tithes and Anka Avram the Moshe, the way he you you lash us you no. Know. Like Master, in Ghana we have freedom of speech. What you say? And if he's saying, if he's making his statement, you cannot tell him to stop. And camera, it be coaching pre. You cannot tell him to stop. So just let's go and think again.
and listen to what Avram is saying. Avram, God bless you. And also be part you and your boys. God bless you. Salam alaikum. So people, you see what our Muslim brother is saying, I support all that he's saying, you know. For instance, he said that Zaki, Zaki is the son of the chief imam in Ghana. And one time Zaki came out to speak because Ousu Bempa was, you know, making a lot of claims or insinuations after he offended the Muslim community and he had to go and beg with a cow and a goat. You know, a very big cow and a goat as well. He had to go and beg because the Muslim community were upset and they wanted to deal with him drastically. But he went to beg. And the thing is, we are asking if your God is all-powerful, with all, you know, supernatural abilities, why didn't he protect you? You were left by your God for the Muslims to deal with you. You see, anyway, let me not dwell on this too much. So, Zaki, the, the son of the chief imam, came out and said, Look, also, please stop all these lies and all this, you know. Oh, what, what word should I say in English? And stop all these schemes, you know. Because we Muslims, Zaki said Muslims have got their own problems. Don't create your problems and involve Muslims in your problems because they've got their own problems. You know? And what I am saying is, Ousu Bampa and his boys, what they are doing trying to incite Islam or Muslims against Afram Bemushe and the common sense movement is is they are they are promoting Isl Islamophobia. Basically, they are trying to present or portray Islam as a violent or an aggressive religion. It's wrong. Don't do that. They are violent or aggressive people across all spheres of life. Even Christians, if you go there, they are people who are violent and aggressive. Yeah, people, for instance, when Pastor Gino Jennings, please, if you don't know Pastor Gino Jennings, go online and put his name in the search engine. Everyone has got phone with data. Gino Jennings went to Jamaica to debate one dancehall artist called Mr. Vegas. You can search for Mr. Vegas as well. He's a well-known or worldwide dancehall artist. And they want to debate in Pastor Gino, Gino Jennings church. And people, look for that video. You see the way Mr. Vegas was treated in Pastor Gino Jennings church in Jamaica. Usher him out. Usher, usher him out. Usher him out. Take his microphone and usher him out. Play the tape. What are you ashamed of? Usher him out. Usher him out. Usher, usher him out. Usher him out. Take his microphone. I'll show him out. 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 Take his microphone and I'll show him out. Play the team. That's how you were saying though. I'll show him out. I'll show him out. I'll show him out. I'll show him out. Take his microphone and I'll show him out. You see, the thing is, what I'm trying to say is aggression across all spheres of life. I believe in freedom of speech. I believe in freedom of religion. You are free to practice whatever religion you want to, you know. If someone wants to believe, fine. If someone wants to be an unbeliever, fine. We should all find the space or the balance to live together or to correlate. So people, before I go, I would like to send this message or these words to Osubempa. Look, 
if you are if you got problems with Avram Bemoshe or common sense family, or if you get a fight, fight your fight. Or when you go on your knees, or when you go in your room, pray to your imaginary God to to strike Avram Bemoshe or his followers down to prove his power. This is the only thing you can do. Do not involve Muslims or Islam into your fight. They've got their own problems to deal with. Yeah? So people, I'll leave you here. Yes. He's a righteous messenger. You know? Peace. A, a, a secret. What's going to happen in the American election? Ah, uh, maybe who saw Bano? Oh, and the Mekan Krana, O Moon Sunday. Mekan Krana will be a new Sobani Bemani Bijana. Man, sorry. Me preaching, I'm saying, who saw Baby Kuta, America for flag? Now, Bemani people so different. No Bana man who I need the Bemani Beji. But Ben Bemani Betra, I want to be. Satam Krana, no Bani Bema. And no be a friend. So, where are we now? Who's going to win the American election? Oh, Susumu Mumbi, the lady, or Bani Befa. But physically? Obana befa. Mm. Mm. Okay. Because on only kutano. So that's a prophecy that we can note down as well. Oh. Reverend also be says Hillary Clinton will win the American election. Papa ekutano. But now we are sure say Obejim. I don't know.